How'd you find me so quickly? Am I that predictable? <laughs> Damn. Well, what are you doing just standing there? Come, sit. What? Quit giving me those nasty looks. I know I said I'd quit soon, but I swear, this was going to be the occasional Siggy. That's it. Just occasional. Got that? So ease your shoulders and cheer up, booger sack. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry if I seem a little grumpy today. It's just... Life is really kicking me in the ass right now. You catch me? I know my life isn't exactly the grandest of lifestyles, but it sometimes just feels like I was born to be nothing but a scapegoat. I know that everyone goes through a tough time, but regardless, it's just, well, sucky to go through. Whatever, though. Enough about me, all right? I'll manage. Somehow, I just needed to let all that steam off my body. <sighs> well, what about you? You got anything you want to tell me? Anything going on in, I don't know, your life? Hmm. Mm-hmm. Sounds like quite the handful on you. Well, whether you believe it or not, just know that you're one tough cookie. People often downplay dealing with their life issues too much nowadays. When in reality, just being able to bear through one's miserable existence is commendable enough. Life's tough as it is, and to literally be born into a life of despair and still have the desire to live to dream, it's impressive. Fate is like a lottery. You chip in a bit constantly in hopes of hitting a fortune one day, but you usually end up with crap or even less than you had to begin with. So you can't really rely on it to get you a good start in life. What you really gotta do is to endure all the hardships you come across. Only through the grind of hard work will you be able to say that you toughed it out and carved your own future. Though, it's easier said than done. So I get that. And there's nothing wrong in being content with your life. Just remember, take things at the right pace. Life may be short, but it is also long. Time is a construct and it is entirely up to the individual to decide what they want to do with it. Honestly, just don't stress about whether people are giving you crap for the stupidest of things. People will forever remain ignorant, especially of your personal situations. So, do what you can. Tough it out because you got this. And when that opportunity comes, strike it like hell with the hammer and nail of opportunity and build yourself anew reliable path. You can do this, okay? I believe in you, but most importantly, you should see your own potential, okay? <sighs> Jeez, that was a lot of words coming from my mouth, even for me. I think I need to just chill for a second and have a smoke break. <laughs> hey, what are you... <coughs> oh, oh, man... I was smoking that. <sighs> Damn impolite goblin.
What? Nothing. God. What's that now? I smell like cigarettes. <laughs> wow! Quite the detective you are. Hear that, everyone? I smell like cigarettes. Thank you for the heads up, Captain Obvious. Why don't you tell me what's above us? The sky, the stars, extraterrestrial entities, planets? <laughs> Dumbass. <sighs> hey now, I, I was just being real with you. You're the one who started it. It was very rude of you to throw away my cigarette, even if you are trying to help me, kiddo. You give me sass, I sass you back. It's all in the rule book of um, sassing. And, uh, technically, I am your elder. Because I'm a year older than you, so don't force me into making you address me as your senpai from now on. <laughs> yeah. Now that's a little weird. I won't do that. But, but my, my, my point still stands. You should respect me, okay? Uh, oh, who am I kidding? I know you mean the best for me. I'm sorry. You know, I've just been recently struggling. Why don't I make it up to you? Mm, ah, here, put your head on my lap. I know a way to relax your nerves. Maybe even put you to sleep. Come on, chop chop. Don't be shy now. My thighs don't bite. Look, we should just relax for now, okay? No arguing. We should enjoy this beachside view while we have this moment to ourselves. It's really cozy here. Especially with the crackling bonfire sounds. Just there, you know? Come on. Head on my lap now. Spring from now on to make you more relaxed and more in tune with your surroundings. Okay. Are you all snug and cozy, wozy? I should totally snap a picture. Uh, I'm just kidding, okay? I'll stop teasing you. <laughs> I'll make you relax, don't worry. Don't worry. So just close your eyes and feel my hands caress your head gently. like the waves you hear in the background. You need to just relax. 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 You have such nice hair. I actually forgot to compliment you for your hairstyle earlier. Only you would be able to rock that look. <laughs> Kidding. No opening your eyes. Even if it's to glare at me, you actually need to rest a bit. Okay. So. Shh. Shh, little baby. Shh. <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm just teasing you, okay? Can't a friend tease? Damn. Uptight. Much. Relax. Calm yourself. Calm, 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 calm. Man, your hair 
Water is so nice feeling. Ah, it's like I'm touching a cloud. Or like a very well-groomed horse. That's a compliment. Take it as a compliment, okay? Horses are majestic creatures. I will not take any horse slander. <laughs> are you all comfy? never exactly given a, a thigh head massage before, so uh, forgive me for being a noob here. <laughs> you know, a smoke break would really be good about now. Okay, fine. Just relax, relax. Listen and concentrate to the sound of my snaps. Well, how do you feel now? Do you forgive me yet, or are you still butthurt? From my absolute savagery, of course. I mean, you have to admit, I was at least a great masseuse. <laughs> Next time you wouldn't mind doing me on this beach, would you? It's just you looked so comfy receiving those head massages from me. I'm just kind of curious on what it feels like to be affectionately caressed. Uh, pl platonically, uh, of course. <laughs> anyway, before we get out of here, why don't we try dipping our feet into the shore? You know, maybe using the beach for its intended purposes. If we wanted a massage, we could have just gone to a massage parlor. Or hell, <laughs> even a barber. Come on, I won't take no for an answer. Grab my hand. Come on. <laughs> what a surprisingly nice temperature. Usually whenever I go swimming in the beach, the water is usually always sub-zero. Not literally, but it's just super cold sometimes. So cold, it makes my chest uncomfortably hard. <laughs> uh, TMI, my bad. <laughs> uh, but, wow. Just feel that water. <sighs> Such a beautiful environment. This. This is why I love this world. Thank you. For being here with me. I honestly love you for it. Uh, okay, okay, it's getting a little chilly now. Uh, uh, maybe we should head out. Unless you want to stay here for a bit. You're cool too. Okay, yeah, let's let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Making my way back to the shore. Do do do. <sighs> Here, I brought an extra towel. <laughs> okay. Normally, I'd ask you to cuddle up with me for warmth, but... Uh, yeah, not right now. Okay, uh, just g give me a second to warm up. I have a body that has a very hot temperature when it needs to be. Just give me a moment. No, it, 
It's, it's okay. It's really weird how I can just do that if I rub my body fast enough. Um, it triggers my extreme body heat, if that makes sense. It's kind of like a superpower I have. <laughs> Hand warmer, man. <laughs> <sighs> well, I hope you had fun today. You know, for barging in my alone time. I surprisingly don't regret your appearance. I feel like we haven't talked in a bit, too, so uh, today was very much needed. Uh, for my own mental health, of course. <sighs> of course, uh, I'm always here if you need me. I'm just a call away, alright? Uh, is that your car in the parking lot? Alright. Well, uh, be safe. Don't forget to text me you're okay when you get home, and I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> okay. I love you. Bye. <laughs>